Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Lane and welcome back to Madden 18. This is my Legends Fantasy Draft Franchise Mode. We're in week one playing against the Tennessee Titans. And I saw some of their players. They got Jim Kelly, Chad Johnson, Andre Johnson. But the rest of them are going to be a little bit of a surprise. Now we're playing five minute quarters on All Pro. And we have Donovan McNabb as our starting quarterback. If you haven't seen who I picked, you should check out last week's video. It's the whole draft. Well, not... We draft to like round 20 or 30. I think it's round 30 now that I think about it. Yeah, because 11, 11, yeah. About to round 30. If you look on the left side of the screen, though, we got Antonio Brown, Antonio Freeman, Devontae Adams, Terrell Davis. We're pretty loaded on offense, but I picked most of the, for like the beginning of the draft, all on defense. So I'm excited to see what we do there. Now, I did see that they have Richard Sherman. That's probably him on the right side of the screen. They have Richard Sherman. If you did watch last week's video and you're watching this one, you know I was going to pick him. Ooh, so we got Hunter Henry, Jimmy Graham on this field. That's good. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Let's roll out. Now, Donovan McNabb does have some wheels. Let's just get it right to Hunter Henry. Nice. First down, down to the 49-yard line. Now, I'd love to just get this running game started, especially with Terrell Davis. So, on a first and 10 play, we are going to try the run game once again. Oh, throw his first career touchdown pass. That's so Donovan McNabb. Ooh. That was a nice stop right there. Second and nine. We are doing a passing play right here. I think we might try to get it to Antonio Brown over the middle. Now, generally, I like to just dump it right underneath like a short pass, but I'm going to make it a little exciting this week. No, we're not just going to play smart. We're going to play exciting. There we go. Donovan McNabb. Ooh, very lucky right there. Third and nine, we're doing the four vertical play. Usually, I like to throw it to whoever RB is, but it depends what that safety does, so we're going to have to watch him once we hike the ball. Oh, and he's moving over. Okay, there we go. Oh, nice sack. Who was that? Jamie Collins Sr. I was going to pick him too, but we picked Clowney instead. A nice stop by the Titans. Now let's see what our defense can do. Generally, I like to play as defensive linemen, so I should, yeah, Charles Haley, our number two pick. But we also have lights out Sean Merriman, so I might consider being him. Nice stop right there. Steven Jackson is their running back, really. I think they also have Ezekiel Elliott, if I remember correctly, but he's not a 99 overall, which is... A little strange because I think he is a 99 in this game, but maybe they updated the rosters or something like that. But I wouldn't say Steven Jackson is a, a number one starting running back, at least in my opinion. Oh, nice run right there. Tried to get a little too fancy, though. What is that going to get it to? Oh, a third and 10. Okay. Third and 10. Come on, Charles Haley. We have to get off the line right now. Hike the goddamn ball, Jim Kelly. Oh, wow, wow, wow. Wow, he has so much time. Make a stop. Make a stop. Oh, Steven Jackson basically plowed right over my guy. Nice first down by them. So here we are at the beginning of the second quarter, first and 10. We have to make sure we can stop Jim Kelly and uh, Steven Jackson. Who is their wide receivers, actually? That's Chad Johnson. I think that, oh, yeah, I said Andre Johnson the other side. Oh, nice play right there. I thought he fumbled it, though. That camera angle. Do you see the camera angle? How it kind of like zoomed out? That usually means it's a fumble, but I guess not. Second and five. If they get the running game started, we are going to be in big trouble. Come on, Charles Haley. Come. Oh, wow. Such a big hole right there. All right. What is that going to be? A third and three now? Okay. Third and three. We need a big stop right here. Come on, Charles Haley. I was going to say Chaley. That doesn't even make sense. Oh, they're going to be a... Oh, not a running play. Wow. They're a little bit of a chop block, if you ask me. Hit stick. Ooh, Brent Grimes, you got to hit stick him. First and 10, about three minutes left in the second quarter. We did get the ball first, so we need to hope we can make a stop right here. Who is open? They're, they're running backs wide open. Ooh, they're bombing it. He needs, of course, he's open. Of course, he's open. Come on. I can't believe he was wide open right there. We have a first and 10 play, about 2.15 left before half. Ooh, nice stop right there. Might have been a little bit of a face mask, Clowney, but I'll look the other way. I'm not looking. We are going to have to think about calling a timeout very soon. Because if they can just waste another minute and a half and score a touchdown and get the ball back, it's not going to be very good. Wow, so the Ravens have Matt Ryan and Bo Jackson, a former, uh, he was in my last series. I don't know what to call that, former Patriot? I don't know, it doesn't really make sense. I'm the Raiders now. But what is that now? First and 10. See, I wonder, should we be calling the timeout right now? I don't know. Oh, the passing game is starting to heat up. <laughs> a first and 10 from the 14 is in the shotgun formation. Oh, nice touchdown right there. That was, ooh, we hit it out. Nice. All right. I was, I was giving that one away, saying that was a touchdown. Second and 10, a minute 37 left. That was a nice stop right there. I'll have to admit that. Oh, Jim Kelly's going to start to run. You can see it. Ooh, that's way out of bounds. Who is there? Oh, wait, I think they have Tyler Eifert. Yeah, there we go. Tyler Eifert. We actually might make a stop. Kick, let them kick the field goal. Be down by three. Have enough time with all three of our timeouts to make something happen before halftime. But we shall see. 
Come on. Let's go. Get off the line. Get off the line. Get off the line. Come on. There we go, Charles Haley. Get the spin move. He's coming. He's coming. Oh, no. He's wide open. Hit that out. Hit that out. No way. Nice catch right there. Who was that? That's Steven Jackson? Really? Now, I'll feel really good if we can at least get a field goal out of this drive. Now, we're doing this little mountain swing thing. I don't know. I think it's like a pass, technically. Yeah, look at this. It's a weird play. Oh, it might work, though. Might work. Let's get that spin move. The spin move's broken. We're going to have to run the hurry up. I want to save a few of our timeouts so we can get downfield. We need about another 20, 25 yards so we can be in field goal range. Come on, Troll Davis. Get back in line. There you go. There you go. Let's get this play off. Oh, it looks like the same play, but little did I know it's not the same play. Jimmy Graham! Yes, Jimmy Graham wide open. Okay, do we even call the timeout now? Probably not. That was nice. You got to admit that. I thought he wasn't going to get open and catch that ball, but he did. So let's try to get him his first career touchdown pass. Oh, nice rush right there. We're going to have to call the timeout now. They pretty much all out blitzed us. Second and 16. I mean, we're in field goal range, so as long as we don't throw another pick six. Or I say another pick six because I recorded a few videos ago. I was throwing them all over the place. But we have a second and 16 right here. 35 seconds left before halftime. Come on. Okay, no one's rushing us, so we have some time. Let's roll out a little bit. Oh, right there. Right there to the other team. Speak of the devil. We have to make that stop. Thank you. Are they actually going to try to get something right here with 27 seconds left? They're going to start bombing it downfield and be screwed. Nope, they're going to run it. Okay, all right. That's not bad. I can't imagine they're going to call a timeout. Yep, all right. That's the end of, before, uh, end of the second quarter. So here we are, beginning of the third quarter. We have to make a stop. They're only up 7-0, so not the end of the world. But yeah, Steven Jackson's running all over us. Wow. Nice move to get out of there, right? Oh, eight yard or eight rushes of 24 yards. Okay. I see a bunch of people playing online or like in YouTube videos, stuff like that. They always play as linebackers, generally the middle linebacker. And we have Patrick Willis. So what is this? Oh, are they going to run it? Oh, they are running it. They're going to run all over us. I just have a bad feeling about that. Let's be Patrick Willis again. What? Oh, actually, where's Patrick Willis? Okay, we're actually going to have to go back to Will Fork. The second Vince Will Fork. Vince Will Fork. Oh, wow, wow, wow. You didn't push him over. No way. And you missed the hit stick. I didn't even pick the hit stick. That's a joke. That is an absolute joke. Let's try this again. We are going to be good old Patrick Willis. I don't know how playing as a linebacker goes. Okay, they're going to rush it. There's a nice stop by Patrick Willis. Maybe that's why they actually do it. Rather than trying to sack the quarterback, they fall back. They can cover a little bit better. And if worse comes to worse, we stop the run. Maybe. It's a shame that Patrick Willis retired so early. He, was, he probably would have been one of the best linebackers of all time. So I'm guessing that means we're supposed to cover Steven Jackson. We're going to try it out. I don't think I'm going to run. Okay, yeah. So we can actually rush technically, right? Oh, no way. No way. What a catch right there. That was beautiful. Okay, we are going to have to make something happen right here. Usually an all-pro, I'm all right. Maybe I accidentally put an all-madden. I don't really think I did, but first and 10. Oh, there we go. There we go. Devontae Adams down to the 48-yard line. I think we're going to run the hurry up the rest of this game if we... I mean, not the rest of the game, but for a while now. Uh, mountain play action post. Come on. There you go, Antonio Brown. Move out over there. Ooh, where's their lineman going? All right. Uh, let's see. Let's see. That's great. That's a holding penalty. So let's just run on over here. And let's slide on down so we can come all the way back. Oh, that's a good chunk of yardage they have to come back, isn't it, Bill? Yeah, so many yards. First and 20. I hate the commentators. If you didn't know that by now, welcome, welcome, welcome. Hopefully the title of this video is Epic Comeback XXX 420X. Woo, nice spin move by ja what the Jimmy Graham. I want to say Jeremy Graham, but that's just not right. So we have about a minute left in the third. We're on the 48-yard line. We should be able to get a first down this drive. And by this drive, I mean this play. Here we go. First, or uh, second and uh, 10. Ah, Jimmy Graham. You better hold on to that ball. Thank you. First down. Let's run that hurry up again. Uh, what are we doing here? What are we doing here? Uh, maybe the four verticals. We'll mix it up a little bit. We'll try to get it to Jimmy Graham or Antonio Brown across the middle. Oh, there we go. Oh, there we go. You dropped that? Really? I hit the throw. They're like, if you want to get back into this game, well, let me tell you something. These are the passes you got to hit. And I hit it. Antonio Brown dropped it if you're watching the same game I am. But I guess you're probably not. I'm just running. Peace. Ooh, got hit a lot right there. I think it's already four down territory. I know technically it probably isn't. But we're going to pretend like it is. Third and one. I think we should be able to get one yard. Yeah, we're just... Ooh, I guess we're not going to run for the first down. I like that even they know it's four down territory. We're down by 14. Five minutes left in the game. 
Let's get this play off. We need a fir Oh, no. Wow. He almost rushed us hard right there. But we have so much room to run. So much room to run. Touchdown. Donovan McNabb. 25-yard touchdown. There we go. Let's make sure we hit this extra point, though. Because for some reason, I'm just not good at kicking. Let's see. Let's get it over here. Let's get it right there. Stop it and stop it. There we go. 14-7. to seven. Here we go. We need a stop from you, defense. Let's be our Patrick Willis again. That's not even Willis. That's Woodyard. Come on, make a stop, make a stop, force a fumble, do something. Now, we have all of our timeouts. It's not quite time to start using them. Uh, we could still obviously get a third down play right here, then stop them on that play, and we'll have like three minutes left, and we need the timeouts for that. Where's Patrick Willis? Come on. There we go. Oh, no, that's Merriman. What's Merriman doing? I don't want to be Merriman. Oh, nice stop right there. Is that Sue? Yes, it is. Nice. I'm very excited to see what Sue does this year when he's playing alongside Dar uh, Donald. I, I, was, I don't know what I was trying to say right there. But we have a third and six right now. We need to make a stop. Come on, guys. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Ooh, make that stop. Yes. Yes. Okay. We are getting that ball back. So we have three minutes and 21 seconds to get downfield and tie the ball game. And I even might go for two so we can try to win the ball game. But first, let's worry about getting that touchdown. First and ten. Oh, Jimmy Graham. Jimmy Graham, hold on to that, please. Okay, he did. Now, we are in a situation we don't really have to run the hurry up. Uh, we don't have to waste any of our timeouts, nothing like that. So let's just play smart, pick some smart plays. We are doing the Shark HB wheel. We got Devontae Adams going across the middle, so that makes me feel a little bit safe. I like having the safety net across the middle. And then I also like just having Jimmy Graham open every single time. Uh, maybe we should run the hurry up. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Let's do the angle smash. Maybe we can get it to Terrell Davis. Yeah, Terrell Davis is in the game. Adams maybe, Graham maybe. Maybe we could just tuck it down and run. But for now, we are just, you better make that block. Better make that block. Let's get out of bounds. First and 10, 223 left in the game. What are we looking at here? Four verticals with Adam going across the middle. Okay, and Marquise Lee's in the game for some reason. And he's wide open. Oh, man, I wasn't sure if he caught it or if it was an interception. That was a little confusing, but good thing he didn't intercept it. Now, what do we want to play right now? Maybe the HB slip screen? I don't think I've tried that yet, right? I don't know how Terrell Davis is as a catching running back. I probably should know that since I love the NFL, but I just don't know. Oh, there we go. We got rid of it. We got some room to run. Oh, you made that block. Good. Still on your feet. Still on your feet. Get out of bounds. Oh, he's still on his feet. Wow. So we just hit the two-minute warning. First and 10. We are going to try a running play with Terrell Davis. So let's see how this goes. Yeah, they're dropping back a little bit. There we go. Oh, I like having a quick, speedy running back like Terrell Davis. Second and one. A minute 40 left in the game. Down by seven. We're doing this little funky play to Terrell Davis. Wow, that was ugly. Third and one, it is still four down territory, obviously. We got Antonio Freeman going across the middle. I think that's who we're going to try to get it to. Let's see, let's see. Yeah, Antonio Freeman, nice and easy. Ooh, I just messed up saying easy too, but nice and easy first down. First and goal, we are running the four verticals. A minute 15 left in that game. Here we go. Let's actually run up in the pocket a little bit, slide. We can't fumble it. For some reason, on second and goal, we're doing the exact same play. Don't really understand the thought process there. But we are going to run it in for the touchdown to make it 14-13. to 13. Now, do we go for two and risk it all? I think we'll make it a little interesting here. Should we do a rollout pass? I think we will. I'm sorry, guys. We're just going to make this. Little, we're not going to try to win every game. Like I said, we're not going to play the whole season. So we're going to mix, mix it up a little bit. Ah, go throw the ball. Shame, shame, shame. Now, let's see if we can get that good old onside kick, shall we? We're going to go all the way up and then not stop it on the way down. Let's see what... Oh, they actually stopped. Got that real quick. Now, technically, the game's not over. We have all of our timeouts. I imagine they're still going to run it every play because if they throw it, they're out of their mind. Yeah, they're going to run it. Okay, now we're going to be able to call a timeout there. They're not in field... Uh, they might be in field goal range. It's going to be really, like, really close, though. So let's find out. Second and 11, I imagine they're going to run again. Let's see. Let's get over to Patrick Willis so we can try to make a stop just in case they throw it. Yeah, I, they, there's no way they could throw it in this situation. Call another timeout. Third and 10. They have to run it again. Maybe they'll take a shot and try to throw it. But if they throw an interception or something like that, that would just be crazy. Yeah, that's what I figured. Nice stop right there. Now, this is going to be iffy. Like I said, I don't know if they're going to punt it away. Or do you, do you almost even just go for it and just hope for the best? Oh, they're actually kicking the field goal. Okay. Can I get over to this left guy, please? Please, please, please. There we go. Ryan, I don't know who you are. We need to block this punt, or this kick, rather. No. Oh, that's, woo. 
Yes, not good. We still have a chance. So we have no timeouts. We only need about 20, 30 yards, something like that. So we're gonna have to catch the ball, get up to the field and spar up to the spot and then spike it. So let's get this off. Ooh, right there, right there. No, yes. He dropped it. No. No, that is such a shame. That would have been so beautiful. That's such a shame. We would have been in field goal range with about no time left. We could have ran up, spiked the ball. I'm just going to run. I am just going to run. Slide. We're going to have to get up and spike it. Everybody back. Everybody back. Oh, everyone's not getting back quick enough. This is not good. This really isn't field goal range. Come on, everybody back. We're going to Oh, we really don't even have a shot at this. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Now, here is the dilemma. I feel like I should even call an audible, do something like this, and hope we can get maybe five or so yards. I'm going to hike the ball. I'm going to tuck it right away. We're going to tuck it. We're going to slide. Get back to the line and run it back to the line. No. We're going to lose. No, 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 no. That's such a shame right there. We lost the game 14 to 13. McNabb went 10 for 16 for 175 with an interception. Jim Kelly, 7 for 10 for 152 with two touchdowns. Let's see what the rushing's looking like. Steven Jackson, 15 rushes, 32 yards. McNabb, 7 for 82 with two rushing touchdowns. God. Uh, Jimmy Graham, 5 for 87. Terrell Davis, 2 for 39. Steven Jackson, 2 for 25. Andre Johnson, 2 for 59. Not bad. Devontae Adams, 1 for 23. Nothing really else. Who the, uh, who's Mons scored? I don't know how to say his name. But that is going to do it for this video. If you liked the video, give me a like down below. Make sure to check out my channel. Subscribe for daily Madden 18 content. This Legends comes out every Thursday at uh, noon. I was going to say 3 p.m. Eastern because that's when all my other videos come out. So make sure to hit that bell to be notified when all my videos go live. And I will see you guys in the next one. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.